That's what we're about. Now, Native, again, black, different. They're just weak. And I'm not being judgmental. Really, they should have kicked the white man's ass. But they decided to be too nice. And uh, they were severely taken advantage of. Same thing as the East. But it's all through economics this has occurred. Because the white man's pretty smart, at least in terms of being selfish. So that's basically what's happened. You see, selfishness was then thought of as the people who were the socialists, they said, oh my God, this is horrible. The United States? The United States is actually going to advocate selfishness? Individual selfishness without no control from us? <laughs> Shit, we can't have that. We have to inject something to control them because they're not mature enough to control themselves. Remember, they're the Jerry Springers, right? They're going to blow up the planet if they're not careful. So we better control them because they can't control themselves. And they were right. Basically, you know, 10% of the people give me liberty or give me death, after how many years are, let me sit on my fat, lazy ass and be taken care of. So you have the rise of the Democrats and the Republicans. Republicans are, I'm going to take care of my own. Democrats are, I'm going to take care of somebody else. But really, what it's about is always taking care of your own. You don't want to be responsible? Be a Democrat. Want well, to be responsible? Be a Republican. But give a shit about nobody else. What a great set of choices, huh? But that's where we are. That's exactly where we are. If you want to hold on these lofty ideals of, you know, world peace and all this total bullshit, let's unite the world under one world government and, and have a beautiful peace, you are fucked up in the head. If you think 90% of the people who don't want to give away their Lexus, who are very interested in having the biggest bang on the block, the biggest bling on the block, got to have the bling bling, right? No, no, it doesn't, that doesn't sound like bling bling. Sorry, that was something else. Maybe, uh, go to have my bling bling, right? You know, go to my, no, that sounds the wrong way to shit. I don't know. Maybe somebody else can respond with a video that actually talks about bling. But, uh, boy, the black men are being fucked over by their own bling right now. But, anyway, because they used to be pretty proud, you know, with the whole Egyptian thing. But, yeah, I got fucked up, too. So, really, what we're looking at here is you. You are not responsible. You're not. You don't want to be. You don't want to know what's going on. You don't want to understand anything. You want to be taken care of cradle to grave. Or you want to take care, or you want to just go off and do your own thing and say, fuck everybody else. Well, I'd much rather have you say, fuck everybody else, because then we don't have a central control structure. But we need one, right? Remember, Jerry Springer. So, we've got the Mafia. We've got the advanced version of the Mafia, which is the central banking structures. You know, which should put their feeling, feelers and talons and whatever you want to call them into every country in the world, squeezing them for the blood that they have out of them. You know, and that's what they're doing. But we need it. Keep in mind, we don't want to do what is necessary we don't want to be responsible. This was the whole concept of the monarchy. The Christ-driven monarchy came from God. Which means, yeah, a couple of people are going to determine what the rest of the people watching Jerry Springer are going to do. Because they ain't qualified. And if you let them in charge, you're going to have total chaos and anarchy. And that doesn't help the people who want to live. So the monarchy decides, eh, shit, well, we better control these people. And we better get our take, because the mafia is about getting your own take, right? you got to extort people. you got to 
you know, make sure that all the factors of human greed uh, bleed into that. But we decided to create an economic system that was openly about human greed, not hidden. It was open. It was wonderful. And people had guns by their doors. And people were like, hey, don't fuck with me. No, I'm serious. So, if that's where we've been, if that's what we are, and we let go of our lofty ideals of what we think we are, or what we want to be, or what spiritually we think we've evolved to, because in most cases we haven't, embrace selfishness. Embrace your own selfishness. Kick those fucking bastards out of the country that think that they need to be, we need to be controlled. Actually, don't kick them out of the country because they really have kind of stuck themselves in a pretty bad hole because, you know, they want to control, but now they kind of got stuck. And they don't want to keep controlling, so. But they want to make the money. And they want to control the resources, but they don't want to deal with all the, you yeah, know, well, difficult people. So, and that's what you got to do. You kick them out of the country. But no, wait a minute now. Ha -ha. Kick them out of the country? You can't do that. Now, let's just look at this from a non-judgmental perspective. I've been a little judgmental. If you have no desire to be responsible, how are you going to kick people out of your country? You have no desire. Yeah, 10% of you. Woohoo! Maybe the whole of the internet. Woohoo! There's a whole freaking world out there. It's on TV. They're watching Jerry Springer. Jerry Springer is about crucifixion. Bread and circus, the Romans. Let's go throw some Christians to the Romans. That's what it's about. Oh, you're gay. Let's kill you. Oh, you're polygamous. Kill ya. Oh, wait. You believe in the spaghetti monster. Flying spaghetti. I'll kill ya. Oh, you had a thought about, I don't know, maybe eating banana pie. I'll kill ya. We don't eat banana pie here. What you talking about? So, this is what they're dealing with. I mean, you can't fault these people who are in control, because at least they're willing to take control. You know, life's a bitch and then you die. 